Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try one of these new uh, Banquet Mega Deep Dish uh, Pies. This one is the Bacon Mac and Cheese. It is macaroni and creamy cheese sauce with pieces of bacon wrapped in a flaky crust. So it's kind of like a pot pie with macaroni and cheese and with bacon in it. So that's, that's basically what it is. The wealth is at Kroger. It was $2.49 for the pie and it is a thousand calories. So not a low calorie meal at all. Uh, if you eat one cup, if you eat half of it, it's only 500 calories. So yeah. So there's your info for you. We're going to ignore all of that. It's a flaky crust made with made from scratch, loaded with uh, cheese, bacon, and deliciousness. It looks really good. So it has directions for conventional oven, and it, and it even says conventional oven preparation is recommended. I'm sure it is, but we don't do ovens on this channel. We do microwaves, so that's what we're going to do. So we're going to open the carton, peel the back, peel back on the perforation to completely remove the top, slit the top crust, cook with the carton top off. So you just leave it in the box, but leave it with, the, but take the top off. Cook seven to eight minutes on high. Um, do not cook a microwave oven below 1100 watts. That's important. You got to have a, a decent size microwave. You can't do them in a small one. Um, and then let it stand for five minutes after it's cooked. So cook it and, and let it sit for five minutes and then enjoy. So I started it on the end over here just so I wouldn't have to fight with it on camera. But people love it when I do that. All right, so it looks like a traditional pot pie, honestly. Uh, the crust looks the same, the, you know, has the same feel about it. So I've got a knife and I'm going to cut the top. Let's just let the steam out. So I'm going to get this in the microwave. I will probably, um, I would say seven to eight minutes. I will probably do it. Um, yeah, seven to eight minutes. I'll probably do seven and a half minutes. Um, I'll probably put it on a paper plate just in case something runs over. Um, but then besides that, I'll be back. All right, here it is out of the microwave. And what I did was in the microwave went off after the seven and a half minutes, I set a timer on my phone for another five minutes. So it's set for five minutes in the microwave. Um, it browned up a little bit on the top and the, and the edges are look pretty good. I'm gonna pull, off, pull that open so we can let some of the steam out and show you what's inside. Um, I smell bacon, but oh, there's a little bit right there. Like I said, I don't get a ton of bacon uh, visible. So I'm gonna break this up a little bit. I always like my, my crust kind of broken up in the middle um, and let it cool off a bit and I'll be back. Okay, I think I've got it cooled off enough to where I can try it. Um, I broke up some of it just to let some of the steam and the heat out. Um, so I've got crust and macaroni and cheese and I think I got a piece of bacon and it's buried in there, but here we go. You definitely get the bacon flavor um, and the macaroni and cheese is good. It's, um, let me just try a piece of macaroni. I'm curious about the texture. It's good. It's, um, it's not too soft or mushy. It's um, actually got a really good texture to it. It's not, um, it's not overly done to where it's soft and it's not underdone where it's kind of hard. So it's got a good texture to it. And the, uh, you really do get the bacon flavor more than, almost more than you do the cheese flavor. The cheese is good. Um, I think it would depend on what bite you get of the macaroni and cheese too, whether you get the bacon flavor, because I don't think it's bacon like all through it. And there's not a whole lot in there. I see a few pieces here and there, but there's not a lot of bacon in there. Um, the crust itself though, is just like a basic, like a pie crust. Hold, I'm gonna take one more bite. Which, I made that sound like a bad thing, but here's the outside of the crust, by the way. Um, it got good and brown and uh, on the outside because the pan itself is like a metal or aluminum kind of looking stuff. So you get brown on the outside of the crust. I like pot pie and I like pot pie crust. Matter of fact, some of my favorite parts of a pot pie is the crust. So, um, so for me, I like this crust the way it is. Um, some people may like, think it's a little plain but uh, for me, it, it, it's a really good, just like a pot pie crust. Um, I 
I'm debating. The the calories, first of all, are going to kill it for if you're trying to get low calories. So you're never going to eat one of these if you're trying to watch your calories. Because um, I don't think this would heat up well, even if you only eat half of it. Um, unless you're sharing it with somebody, I don't think it would heat up well. The, um, the flavors are good. I like the flavors. I wish there was more bacon in it because there's really not a lot of bacon. I do get a bacon flavor occasionally, but it's not every bite. Like I, out of the three or four bites I've taken, I've tasted bacon and maybe one and a little bit in another one. The other two bites, I didn't taste bacon at all. So, um, so it really depends on like this bite has a little piece of bacon on it. And I get that little bit of a smoky bacon flavor. So, um, so just know it's not really bacony. Wish it was had more bacon in it. Needed it. Um, the cheese is okay. It's not like a overwhelmingly powerful cheese flavor either. So really, you're just getting mostly the um, the noodle flavor and the crust flavor. And if you eat a big piece of the crust, like on the side, you literally all you taste is crust. So if you like the crust like that I do, then that's a good thing. But still, that's gonna probably drop my score a little bit because. The flavors are just, just okay. So I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna give it a four. It is a good meal. It's gonna fill you up for sure. Um, it has good flavors to it. I wish there was just um, a little bit more complexity to it, or maybe even if they just added more bacon to it, it would have bumped the flavors up a little bit, and the cheese sauce, uh, a little bit more cheese sauce um, flavoring would have would have added to the to the overall value or the flavor of the meal. So. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna give it a four. Try it out. If you don't mind the calories at all, um, then try it out. If you watch their calories and you um, you only eat like half of this, that's that's fine. It was only it was less than three dollars, so it's not like you can't eat half of it and throw it away. Um, you're not wasting a lot. Um, or just eat the inside and don't eat a lot of the crust on the outside because I'd say that's where a ton of the calories are is around the uh, crust. So um, see, so yeah, I'm gonna give it a four. I um, hope you enjoy this video and thanks for watching.